it's tough out there and well things can get lonely when things are not working out So I am sure I'm not the only one reading about the bad economy, about, you know, the crisis around the world, pretty much in every country, and the people being laid off. It's terrible and it's really, really sad. And it's not just on the news, you know, it's getting closer to home every day. I just found out that the husband of a friend of mine got laid off. I know, sad, sad story. It must be a horrible feeling. And that must be a very lonely feeling too, you know? You're like, what did I do? What? I mean, I guess you must be very isolated. Kind of reminded me when I got, I didn't get laid off, I was fired. And who cares, you know, what's the summer job was different, you know? Yeah, I was working there for three days. <laughs> I know. Still, it felt bad. Yeah, I cannot compare to a real job where your life kind of depends on, on that. I think that's the worst feeling when it hits you and people around you are still standing and you're like, wait a second, what did I do? Why me? I know this is probably a very bad analogy, but I went to a circus two weeks ago and it was breathtaking. Like, crazy mad I was so excited I felt like I was three years old again the things they uh, they can do are amazing and in the culmination of this one act this one performer was kind of catapulted I guess how you say it in the air and was supposed to land on the shoulders of this other person yeah it's supposed to so she's catapulted and those couple of you know jumps in the air and she lands but can't find balance so falls she does again and yeah she falls again a third time oh the third one is a charm isn't it not really not for her not today so she falls and actually it felt pretty bad for her i think we all did except for this one nice guy behind me that was kind of laughing that's okay. He seemed that he had a lot of problems himself, so. And it hit me that you see all these performers doing these amazing things and it seems so effortless. But what you don't see is how internally they must struggle to get to get it right and how close they are to falling and failing sometimes. And how actually probably every single one of them falls once in a while no isn't it kind of part of the job job i guess no yeah i think so is that kind of just like life i think no agree with me agree if you don't agree i will put a happy face or no 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 a pirate face i have been feeling recently that so much of my life is like a balancing act just like walking on a stretched rope and trying not to fall. And especially when I read the newspapers or watch the news, I feel like people are just like that, trying to balance themselves, trying not to fall. When I was thinking of the idea for this week's painting, I wanted to depict, first of all, the disappointment of, of the performer who lost her balance. She is sitting here on the rope with her head down and not too hot, not too happy. Her spirit is broken and I guess it is kind of hard to find motivation to get up and go on. But what I really wanted to emphasize is the idea that the performer is not alone. The other ones obviously struggle as well. Very likely more of them um, will fall but just the feeling that they all struggle in the same way gives them this sense of i guess being in this together 
and that gives them motivation to try again because after all it's not like they were or that they are asked to walk on the sidewalk mm -mm. and walking in a teeny tiny tight rope it's not easy nobody can blame them if once in a while you know they lose their balance mm -mm. Okay, that's it for today and I will see you guys next week and maybe I'll have a surprise for you in the middle of the week. We'll see. We're reviewing the wine of what is left of it. Eat your cookies. Hmm.